to Portland and that is fill up my tank because I'm on E going on an adventure by myself do whatever I want I, I actually uh, got a place it's like a hotel it's not necessarily a hotel it's basically I think like this one big room and there's bunk beds and then each bunk bed is like has its own like curtain to have their own privacy or whatever and it has good reviews and the pictures of the place it looks pretty nice like clean and fancy and I think it's basically meant for uh, people who just want to swing by for one night while they're traveling like it's just meant for travelers I think it is kind of different for me because I've never done anything like that before but I'm willing to try new things and explore in Portland a little bit it is probably like 10 o'clock right now it's gonna be about a two to three hour drive to get to Portland and I want to be able to spend some time up there before the concert so I'm trying to get there earlier that way I have more time to spend in the city and take pictures and do videos all that fun stuff before I uh, started hitting the roads towards Portland and now I'm officially heading south towards Oregon. I'm so excited! <laughs> I am kind of tired and I feel like maybe halfway pulling over to take like a quick nap but I want to get there. I, wanna, I don't want to take any breaks. I might stop just to stretch because I get pretty stiff when I'm sitting for a while and but I just want to get there as fast as I can so I can spend most of the time before the show uh, in the city and everything. It, I, it's, I saw a sign that said next right, so I was thinking maybe like one more exit and then it'll be the next one. So I missed it. Looks like I'm just gonna go all the way and have to deal with the stiffness in my butt. It hurts, <laughs> but that just means I'll get there sooner and I'll have more time to do things in kinda I actually paid for overnight parking so I it was like almost impossible to find parking in this area and I literally drove around for about a half hour trying to find a spot to park my car for the night now I just want to walk everywhere I go here um, it's a nightmare <laughs> the place I'm actually staying is right over there and then the venue where yellow card is playing is actually down the road so I'm gonna go walk down the little ways things I saw on the way. I went to Voodoo Donuts and tried one of their Fruit Loop Donuts which is not too insane but um, I just wanted to try it. I didn't even know it existed it here. I thought it was more like outside of the city. Um, I'm coming back to my car because I have to wait till 3 and I still have about an hour and a half left and I want to call up the venue place and ask if I can bring a DSLR camera in so I can bring this baby in. Scratch that. Uh, all they have really is email, and I don't want to email them because I know I won't get hurt. I won't hear back from them till like probably tomorrow. It's kind of last minute, so I am. Just, I'm just gonna go walk back up there and see if I could get inside and ask if I could bring the camera in. My thoughts on the city is pretty different than Seattle. There's a lot more involved. There's more construction. It's more compact, and there's less parking. <laughs> Or approved by a photo pass. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. Is there any way I can get a photo pass here, or you'd have to contact the tour themselves, okay. and yeah. that's that's you know the one 
thing. Most most of the, the the tours anymore, that's what they're doing. If you contact them ahead of time, put in a request through like their marketing or whatever. Yeah. Then usually they'll put it in on their guest list. Okay. Yeah. I, gotcha. right. I appreciate it, man. Hey, you're yeah. very welcome. Yep. Yeah. Excited to see yellow card tonight. <laughs> yeah, I got no luck. Oh, I'm kind of last minute he was saying I talked to another guy I found another guy that was actually walking into the gates where their tour bus was at and I Couldn't help myself but ask him to see if he knew anything about the photo pass and if he could get me in or whatever But um, he pretty much said he pretty much said the same thing that the guy said that was in the office that um, I would have to contact the, the tour the tour manager and ask him for a photo pass and everything so Looks like I can't bring this in but maybe another time um Kind of sucks because it's yellow cards last tour and kind of bummed out. Wish I could just get in and try and take the last bit of pictures, but oh well. I'm just gonna chill in my car now and uh, rest until three o'clock. quite a long time now watch some videos and stuff just checking on my car um, I'm gonna go line up for yellow card pretty soon because I want to be early so I can get in front of the front of the line I'm not gonna be able to bring, bring my camera in so I might sneak in my GoPro to get some footage at least and if you don't see anything after that then I'm sorry about that uh, hopefully I'm, I'll probably be able to bring my GoPro in and get something but other than that, I think I'm just gonna call it a night because I just wanna take in everything else and not have to record it and just, you know, enjoy the moment while I'm here. So I will see you guys tomorrow. I might do something else epic tomorrow, so stay tuned. Don't forget to stay strong, dance, and live life. Take care.